Good evening, folks. Let's make sure my camera's actually set up properly this time. Yeah, that should that should be nice. All right. Good evening, everyone. We are back, and actually on a somewhat reasonable time frame on here. It's been a uh, quite an eventful week. You'll have to excuse the background noise here. However, I have enough fans um, in my office here to power a small wind turbine, so. We're just trying to keep cool. <laughs> if the background noise becomes an interference, which it's looking like it might, I might have to at least cut off one of them. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna drive me nuts. Uh, you know, it's the difficulty of summertime, right? Beautiful beaches, sunshine, and heat, which are all kind of working against us in this case. So. Tonight, folks, we have a kind of a special... Can you still... Can still hear you okay? Oh, okay. That works. Um, so, in any case, um, we have kind of a fun little bit going on tonight. Um, first of all, we're going to be going over some of the patch notes for uh, 1.09 in Mass Effect Andromeda. Good things, majority, like the majority of things are good few concerns and gripes that I'm going to get into very quickly on here. Um, first of all, let me real quick bring up the notes. Also, side bit of good note, um, after some late night surgery with a decent amount of assistance last night, um, we were finally able to resurrect the G13, so um, fortunately enough, I now have that back and I can now game properly. You have no idea how happy that makes me, honestly. <laughs> Anyway, so let me pull up these patch notes on here. Now, we're going to focus on the multiplayer pa patch notes. There were some single player changes on there, but we're not going to really focus on those because uh, it would just take too long. So, first of all, the, the biggest part of it, the largest chunk of the patch notes on there, is that um, they added Platinum difficulty, which, for those of you that played Mass Effect 3 multiplayer, this is about the same time that they released Platinum in Mass Effect 3. It's essentially a, a, a difficulty tier above gold where enemy types mix together to go against you. Not necessarily anything that goes with lore, because, I mean, in the last game you had Reapers and Geth and um, you know collectors, collectors weren't even in Mass Effect 3, um, that would team up against you. So it was kind of like, it didn't really make sense. Anyway, um, this game we obviously don't have the, well, yeah, anyway, we don't have the collectors in this case, but uh, that might as well be the cat, am I right? Um, aside, from, uh, aside from that, we also had the Batarian Scrapper um, get introduced, which um, in a interesting twist, the Batarian Scrapper reintroduced one of my favorite powers from Mass Effect 3, Snap Freeze. Now I highly doubt that it's as broken as fuck as it was in Mass Effect 3 because it was legitimately broken in Mass Effect 3. Uh, there's no two ways about that. Um, however, even without it being broken, we do have the benefit of um, having a different ice power other than cryo beam, which to me cryo beam was a little bit too slow You had to like stand there and aim it at people and it was just kind of a little unwieldy use That works for flamer because you kind of just hose flamer around and and enemies get caught on fire and take damage over time from it but cryo beam has always been kind of a little bit of annoyance because it's literally like you have to hold it on the target for several seconds before it feels like it does what it needs to. Um, but Snap Freeze is back. He also has um, heavy melee. He's got the signature Batarian gauntlet melee, which is awesome. Um, and then we also had the Kishok sniper rifle, one of, one of my more entertaining weapons that I liked. Um, I mainly liked it because I loved the whole damage over time. I would get the the uh, Batarian Slasher, you know, hit an enemy with Ballistic Blades, hit him with Charged Kishok, you know, and just start like stacking dots on enemies. And I always found that fascinating. It was kind of also the, one of the reasons why I loved um, the Asari Huntress in that game, which of course, unfortunately, she's not the same in this game. In the last game, you would snap on Attack Cloak to get the damage bonus, and then you would hit an enemy with Dark Channel, and it would do absurd amounts of damage over time. Um, it was one of the most 
a, like heavily damaging powers in that game whenever you combined it with uh with that anyway hey bry how you doing oh and also hi rose um you snuck in there right underneath that um and i guess i didn't see you or i did i don't know anyway um so moving on from that so they added um variants on weapons which i haven't quite gotten clear how the ver weapon variants work they seem to um i don't know we'll, we'll we'll get to that the variants on the weapons though are you have uh bulwark um siphon and concussive variants of weapons and essentially those add a modifier to the gun to kind of tailor it to your experience so ball work gives you damage resistance whenever you're near other players um siphon adds a, a a health steal effect where essentially whenever you um deal damage you get health back and concussive which is a really interesting one when you kill an enemy by shooting them in their weak point it causes a, a biotic detonation which is kind of fascinating to me um that one actually is is really cool for for crowd control um bulwark seems to be kind of a tankier one but as i found out it does not give the damage resistance to your whole team it's only to you which that's kind of the part that annoyed me i was hoping that it would be like this overlaying stacking benefit where if you got four people with ball work all stacking on top of each other maybe one of them was an angaran insurgent with bioelectric ward and then you would have upwards of 200 damage resistance from that which would be awesome but that's not the case um, so aside from that, um, we also they spread out these new additions into the actual item store, not the uh, normal loot boxes that you buy. Um, and the reason why is because they didn't want to dilute the loot, loot tables in the uh, in those boxes, which, or at least that's what they say, and I can kind of agree. Unfortunately, that means that they cost mission funds instead of credits, so that's a kind of an issue on there. Now, uh, here in a moment, we're going to be joining in Anchor since she looks like she's finishing up with her match. But the last part I want to talk about here, and this is the part that's concerning me the most, is Veteran Ranks. So Veteran Ranks, if you didn't know, is more or less you can level up your character now past rank 10. Yes, you know, that RNG system uh, for ranking characters and locking their skills behind, uh, you know, RNG that I complained about from the beginning with Ranks. Yeah, so now they've added even more ranks to a character so that now, even when you get them to rank 10, you're not done yet. You can still keep getting them as drops. What this actually is, as the term that Billy used when he answered my question about it, I'm not kidding, he said, extend the progression. Translation, increase the grind. If this was an end game only feature, where you would not unlock the ability to get veteran ranks until you had all of your character cards at least maxed out, I would be okay with it. But it's not. You can get it at any time. It literally means that you're going to keep getting drops of the characters that you already have maxed out, and you know, like in my case, I'm never gonna fucking see that uh, that exemplar ever drop for me. Whereas I'm gonna have the common characters at rank you know, XXL fucking ridiculousness. Then there's the other problem. The veteran ranks add a small percentage um, stacking bonus to those characters the higher the rank you go. Uh, it adds power damage, melee damage, and combo damage. Notice that weapons actually just get kind of fucked in this case, first of all. That kind of sucks, so if you're doing a pure weapons build, and eh, then your veteran rank means absolutely nothing. But... Going on that, the major thing that I kind of run into is this is the exact same problem that we had with Dragon Age Inquisition's multiplayer, where people can just grind and grind and grind and grind and hit the stratification where they just keep rising in power, where you have this person with a rank L, L is a Roman numeral for 50 by the way, rank L a sorry adept who's doing freaking you know a hundred percent more um power damage combo damage all this stuff it's like at what point does that become broken what if i have a rank m fucking character yes rank m as in a thousand what if i grinded to the point where i had a rank m character what point would there be to any difficulty to me if all i had to do was just grind and grind and grind until i had all these re veteran ranks up 
That is the wrong fucking way to do it. Lock it down to endgame people, where people who have maxed their manifest, that's cool, because that gives them something to do after they've already maxed out everything. But you have to cap it. You have to cap it. You cannot, like, you. it's Bioware still not getting why people play Mass Effect multiplayer. It's not for the grind. They play it because it's fun to play with other people. That's the whole reason why all multiplayers have this this um, continuation. You keep giving them them content, the new stuff for them to kind of see new variations into the game. Yes, not because they get to grind for it more. It's because they're just having fun in new ways. That's all it is. It's variety. Am I enjoying the patch? Um, we'll see. <laughs> Um, it should be enjoyable, but uh, let me go ahead and throw the patch notes over here real quick I'm gonna unmute myself in anchors channel. Hopefully um, she's not in the middle of talking to something. <laughs> we'll find out Hello anchor do you have anything muted over here? Yeah. You know surprisingly that is a tough You know what no, it's a lighter. I can get three shots off quicker Let's also Let's do that. That is much better for him. What equipment did I have? Gorilla, sniper, and pistol. Okay. Also, by the way, if any of you guys want to... Um... He's ready for platinum. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I think what I'm going to do... I'm going to take a quick break. And then once we're back, I should... We should be doing that multi-stream with Angelus as well. Let's get this set up here. Well, as you guys can hear, she's obviously, uh, yeah, no, no, she has me muted. I realized that very quickly. I was just trying to snoop in and see what she was actually saying. Um, so as you guys heard there, she's going to take a break, then we'll come back to her. Anyway, so let's, let's, uh, let's talk here for a moment about the, uh, the, the veteran ranks thing so um as someone found out and i don't know if it's a it's a curve that the higher the veteran rank you get the more bonus you get um but from what someone's saying it sounds like um the top of my oh for fuck's sake god damn you camera it fell i've been uh futzing around in my office of late and uh everything's fucked up yeah <laughs> i have i have debris behind me it, uh, it's crazy. You guys have no idea how crazy my office is right now. Um, there's, uh, I don't even know what the hell's going on with this light here. There we go. I've got cords pulled tight. Everything's fucked up. This is professionalism right here, guys. Pro stream. Pro stream. This is the stream where you guys just get to listen to me cuss and uh, and swear a lot, because that's that's how I stream, yo. Family friendly for life, guys. Okay, so I think we're getting better. We're getting closer. We're getting closer. Oh oh oh. There we go. That should be that should be somewhat good. I'm still cutting my fucking head off here. So, um, yeah, favorite kind of stream, favorite kind of stream where, uh, Mordiel, um, can't get his camera shit sorted. <sniffs> GG. Um, so in any case, um, so with what I was, my kind of concern with, uh, this sort of, uh, I, <laughs> this sort of setup that they create where you essentially have these, um, infinite growth potentials. Oof, and a very large head, by the way. Um, these these loops where you can g uh, gain infinite like levels of toughness or whatever, it always becomes a hey. There we go. Now we're now I think we're in a safer spot. Okay. Um, so what you ran into with uh, with Dragon Age Inquisition is there was a few people I played with. They're cool people. No 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 ill will against them. Um, but they loved that grind. They loved to grind and grind and grind and grind and grind. Um, and they would end up with just ridiculous amounts of uh, promotions in that game. And it just completely broke difficulty to the point where 
they had to introduce two new difficulties specifically for people with high promotions. That's not the way you should be designing difficulties. You shouldn't be di designing difficulties based upon the amount of grinding someone's done. And unfortunately, that seems like what they might have done here. They seem to insinuate that in order to run Platinum effectively, you're going to have to grind out them veteran ranks. Although, to be fair, I think there's probably a few people uh, that are in Apex Spec Ops that are going to disagree with that. Yeah. <laughs> um, but in any case, moving on. Um, so they also did do some damage bonuses on here. Um, they gave the Avenger S. S stands for bullshit. Sorry, I'll call that the Avenger BS. All those S rank variant weapons, I call them the BS variants because they're a bunch of fucking bullshit. Anytime you are arbitrarily freaking... Uh, <laughs> you're you're arbitrarily adding duplicate weapons into the game is a bunch of crap anyway the avenger s got its damage increase which is nice because I, I guess it adds another weapon that's viable at higher difficulties the falcon got some really nice buffs to it so they increased the damage to it up to 500 um, which is pretty potent. That's on par with, I think, the Scorpion's grenade damage, or maybe a bit less, but still up there. Uh, they gave it increased its max ammo up to 45 from 38, and then they also increased the explosion radius to 3 meters, which is nice. The paw also got a nice little bonus on there. Um, looks like Anchor's back, so I'm going to mute here. Anyway, so... Then they also uh, did uh, some other upgrades here and there, but yeah, that was good stuff. Anyway, Anchor has me mu uh, ha is muted, so uh, I she won't be able to be heard over here until she unmutes herself. <laughs> uh, uh, let's Angel, hop over to the are game. You there? there she is. I can't seem to hear you. Oh no. Oh my. Can you not hear me? Do you have me I muted? I this is my settings. Let me see something. I know I, I know that my voice is there, and I know that everybody can hear my glorious voice. And the reason why is because I settings. can see my little little circle in Discord lighting up. So, totally not me. Totally not my fault. Okay. Guys over on Anchor's channel, just uh, just just tell them that. Uh, just tell her that. That I know she's there and I can hear her. She just needs to figure out how to turn her sound settings to uh, to be able to hear me right. Um, anyway, Raven's me blood. Welcome to the Anchor Fam and Farai. Welcome as well. Let me shoot her an invite real quick and then I'll type into her chat and let her know that she needs to change her audio device See. over to her headphones. <laughs> okay. and join your match here. I'm trying to find... Oh gosh, I gotta sneeze. Where are the sound settings? Anyway, so uh, yeah, good times. Reason, it seems like every time I upgrade my GPU driver, it does this. Now all the damn unread markers. <laughs> all right, so uh, so this is Carnifex Siphon. Okay, so I've got uh, got that. That's nice. Input. Here we go. Input device. Output device, dear. Output. No, we won't be able to hear her because she just changed her her input device. Oh. Hello, Damon. Lurk. Everybody having a good time. Anchor's working on getting her sound stuff set up. We can hear her, but she can't hear me. Which arguably may or may not be that important. <laughs> We're only going to go into platinum without her being able to hear me. His uh. voice settings, the output should be... My Yeti. 
No, you the output me, right? should be Angelus your headphones. And everybody watching our technical difficulties. <laughs> Oh my. Yes, Rose, thank yes, you. Yes, there you are. <laughs> oh, you can hear me now. Yes. <laughs> that doesn't make sense. Why would it be output? Okay. Uh, output mind. is where the sound goes. Input is where the sound comes from. Oh, okay. <laughs> Your voice goes <laughs> in every day, huh? <laughs> and my voice comes out. That is actually a very disturbing thought when you think about it. <laughs> How are you doing today? I am having fun ranting as as per my usual about the veteran ranks and how they are deeply concerning oh, okay the uh you, the double x yeah well i mean you didn't play as much of the dragon age inquisition multiplayer as i did Not to see too the, much it, the concern is stratification essentially you give people an endless degree of upward mobility where they can continually go up and up and get more and more powerful at what point does difficulty mean nothing whenever you have like i said a, a rank l asari adept which is you know yeah. like 50 promotions or uh, 50 cards extra or whatever yeah it's just uh Yes, you will get both of our voices on both of our streams. Um, <laughs> that's because uh, we're in a Discord server together. So the easiest way to go about that is just mute one of them, as as Rose yeah. says. Thank you, Rose. Um, so yeah, that's the easiest way. And uh, don't worry, I will scream like an adolescent child when we go into Platinum, um, just to make sure that everybody's thoroughly entertained. And that has already been proven for me. <laughs> so it will be plenty of panic moments. Yeah, let's not do the surgical strike though on Platinum. That looks like a freaking nightmare. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's uh, uh, you have limited ammo and it's on Platinum? Yeah, that seems like a good plan. Good plan for... <laughs> yeah. And let me go ahead and find a level one character to bring in here. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm totally... Wait, what? <laughs> I'm not doing <laughs> I kind of... That went over my head for a second. I'm like, <laughs> but please don't do that. <laughs> No, I think I'll uh, I'll bring in my uh, sorry sentinel, and then uh, okay. everybody bringing in their kineticists. Yeah, I think I'm gonna stick with my Solarian and Voltrader. They did upgrade the uh, um, what do you call it? The uh, s the scatter shot. Huh? They, uh, they gave the scatter shot and the equalizer and the paw more damage. Oh, nice. So I think, yeah, it's so close. I'm at minus one percent. Minus minus one percent. It's that's uh, it's almost it's almost annoying how close that is. Oh, you know what? While I'm thinking about it, um, since I do have enough mission funds, I'm gonna go ahead and grab the mental focuser because that's actually a very perfect um, upgrade for the sorry Sentinel since she has both tech and biotic on here. Okay since it's generic power upgrade rather than uh, biotic or tech. I think I'm ready. I don't know if you can truly be <laughs> are, are ready, ready for platinum. Are you really ready? <laughs> Let's see, what are the, mod are there any modifiers? No, this is just a- No, we're just doing straight platinum, platinum yeah. Uh, oh, mainly gosh. because I, I kind of want to ease myself into it. But we don't know what we're expecting, though. <laughs> Get uh, Disruptor 4 Amos. I've, I've got all my ultra rares I'm bringing in here. I'm, I'm holding nothing back. <laughs> okay. I've been saving these just for this occasion. Nice. All right, 
I'll go ahead and ready up. Uh, do we want to do random random or do we want to actually pick anything? Um, I'm okay with random unless you want to do a certain... Oh, I'm good. One. Oh, and there we go. Nightbot just posted a link in case you would like to view both perspectives at the same time. Just if you're viewing both at the same time, just mute one of the streams because you'll be hearing both of our voices. I personally think that that's actually the best yeah. way to do it. The more times you can hear our voices echoing in your head, the better your life is. And the more biotic combo explosions. <laughs> oh, this map. Oh, well, see, that's... Fun. You know, multi-twitch is kind of interesting the way that it has the, uh, I use Cadgar because I don't know why. Oh, I've just not used that too much. It's same thing, does the same thing. The difference is, is it shows them side by side instead of on top of each other. Okay. Um. Don't, don't make, embarrass me too badly. <laughs> Can't promise that. <laughs> No promises. No, oh, no and promise. it's nighttime to mirror the dreariness that we're feeling. Yep. I'm going to go to the hill at the back because I know that's a defensible position. I'm going to follow you. You know, one thing I've noticed is performance is very much improved. In some areas, I'm noticing a little, little hiccup on here, but then again... I, it's been major be for me. Oh, oh no. Did he uh did he get stuck loading? Uh oh. Okay, they're up. Man, I have to get used to playing with mouse again. I was playing with uh No shield. Oh boy. Yeah, this is actually not gonna be that uh, defensible after a very short period of time. Team and there we go. <laughs> And it begins. <laughs> and it begins. I might... <laughs> oh gosh. Merrick, Merrick got to me. <laughs> oh my. Okay, I'm reviving. Okay, I'm I'm probably going to have to as well. Oh Avenger. crap. Yeesh. Well, I'm I'm beside you guys. <laughs> Shields are Where's, gone. Which one's my revive? Okay, there we go. Oh my. Watch your back. You know what? Oh no. <laughs> oh gosh, this is. Oh, and there I go. Wow, okay, so those observers, first of all, are just brutal. Get up! That was that was certainly quick. To be fair, um, I, I'll, I'll take full responsibility for saying, hey, we should corner ourselves. That was a great idea. <laughs> God, good grief. You know, this is time to bring out Warden. I think everybody's just like, we're not ready for this. Are gone. I want to at least get something out of it. Squad member this. Down. God, this is this is just terrible. <laughs> terrible. See, that's the reason why I wanted to do this with Anchor because she has that Morden doll and that he just makes everything I'm better. <laughs> and he literally fixes glitches. <laughs> at least for a Dragon Age, he does. <laughs> Squad member down. Oh gosh. oh gosh. Oh, they still see me. It seems like they see me when I'm cloaked still. They technically do because, I mean, you're not actually visible to them. It just dumps your uh, aggro rating. You know, like in uh, you know, Dragon Age, they had aggro for everything, like how enemies paid attention to you. Ooh. Oh my. I don't even know which way's up anymore. Fortunately enough, the enemies are not too terribly fully clumsy. But uh, they do a lot of damage. I'm gonna see if I can get the anchor. Oh no, no, I did have to be an observer there. Ah! Uh -huh. Pain of my existence. You know what? I think I'm actually gonna switch back to the Ishere from the Black Widow. I had better luck with that last Platinum. Let's see if I can uh, get some Argus over there. 
trying to keep everybody alive. I don't know why. I'm just prolonging the inevitable, it feels like. Oh, wait. Where did he go? Oh, I think he died. Oh. <laughs> and I died, too. I'm just taking a I'll nap. Get ya. Don't mind me. Oh, oh uh, no. <laughs> I don't know if I want to spam all of my revives on this. Well, fortunately enough, they have the mass... Um, Mass packet or uh, packs now, where I can just buy a bunch of them. Oh no 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 no! This sure. that's, there, and there was the last one. Hey, what's up? All right. We're just we're just chilling, just relaxing. Oh. They definitely still see me. <laughs> oh my gosh! Yeah. Yeah. Oh gosh. Oh. Oh no, that is the worst time to get grabbed by an Audi. No, you are not even nice. So if you guys want a taste of what time it is. Yeah, this is this is fun. <laughs> off, Especially I go on this map time. at night. <laughs> and there you go. And that was the last revive. <laughs> just can't get out of there. Most of it is the aggressively hyper hyper accurate fire from those those observers that that gets me even on gold it's painful mm -hmm. uh, well guys i think this this gave a, a nice summary to to platinum and how embarrassing it is for me to play platinum apex team down <laughs> it's over we'll do it though we'll do it Dead in 15 seconds yes cargo i think that that accurately sums up platinum for at least me when um well you said you played it earlier <laughs> mm -hmm. lurk on my stream good stream good night everybody <laughs> <laughs> and that was it guys uh so that took all of uh what, 15 minutes and done look at that top the scoreboard i a got whopping... a bronze medal <laughs> <laughs> you got a bronze medal in revives. What did I get it for? Revives. In five minutes. Five minutes you got a bronze revives medal. <laughs> that is that is gotta be a record somewhere. Is, okay, let's uh let's not let's oh, uh -huh. oh my goodness. Oh. So I <laughs> So let's see we call it Gather Resources, which is ooh, I've played that one before. Pretty much as soon as your shields break, you're done. That's that mission. Because it's minus 75% health, but plus 100% shields. Okay. <laughs> Putting my Ishere back on. And that's Remnant, because we just love those observers so much. So let's check it out. I just love the explosions with this guy. My incarnate surgeon that I bring with a venom and a scorpion because well, why not? Let's see the insurgent. I don't know. Yeah, I haven't played him yet. He's fun. I'm trying to think. I'm gonna do a tech power amp. And I need to use my pistol more, but yeah. Let's do that. Hyper shields. I feel like that there needs to be uh, I, I I need we need to get the guy, the announcer from um uh, what is it? The, the rare fighting game. Killer Instinct. Guy that goes, mm -hmm. uh, that says ultra all the time. Oh, gosh. Yeah. yeah. Just because there's nothing quite as fun as that. All right, so this time, uh, without dying in five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Cargo. Chrysler just I called. Cry. <laughs> they, they, they need a team of crash test dummies for their latest cars. <laughs> that is that is brutal, Cargo. Sign That's me brutal. up. Thanks for <laughs> sacrificing yourselves for the greater good. Uh... 
I was even firing off cobras, and they really didn't do much at all. Well, uh, so they just kind of tickled. Yeah, it seems like there might be something broken with the cobras, because I was even hearing reports from Justicar Steph, uh, another one of our uh, press streamer friends in the mm -hmm. family, so to speak, um, that she was saying that even on silver, cobras were you not the killing boss. It feels really, really okay. odd. I feel like I think they, I experienced the same. Well, it, see, I think they, they so they took away the weak point um, damage of them, and they were supposed to have like kind of buffed the area. But uh, I feel like they might have broke something in the process. Oh, that missed. And my assault turret doing all the work. Don't mind me, I can just relax and not really. Oh, they finally killed it. Teammate injured. Oh no. Gotcha, Beric. Senor Zinom, welcome to the anchor fam. Oh. What got ya? Guys, this is a summary right here, just, just so everybody's aware. If you follow Anchor's channel on Twitch, one of our teammates will die. It's I'm just a symptom. Away. That didn't come out the way. I was intending that to be a, a incentive to follow her. Let me try to make that sound trollier. <laughs> In glorious fashion. In glorious time. fashion, there we go. Was it meant, I realized after I said that, I was like, wait a minute, that actually sounds like I'm trying to tell people that. Oh, wait, oh. Can I melee you to death? Shooting. There we go. I am playing the wondrous troll. The wondrous troll? Yes, because no matter where they go, things Enemy blow them down. up. It's Take kind of kind of rude, honestly. <laughs> you know that one person that every time you uh, bring to a party, they kind of take a little bit too much and they they are a little bit embarrassing and you kind of just kind of put your hand over your eyes and pretend like you don't know them? You have to actually <laughs> a guard insurgent. He's back. Nice. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna maniacally as enemies foolishly keep walking into it and not realizing what's about to happen to them. I need to try that character. <laughs> it's going to be my next build guide uh, that I'm, I'm putting together now. I just got him up to level 20 and I'm kind of excited nice. to get him to put together because he's actually... I, I really enjoyed the talent Merc from Mass Effect 3 multiplayer. The into civilian oh, yeah. We need to take out their and that's devices. kind of what uh, he feels a lot like. Enemy tech Unfortunately, I don't have the Omni crossbow that the talent Merc has. Now, the timing on these has been so decreased. Oh, yeah. Well, it's because they give you 45 seconds per device as opposed to a bulk time. 
Don't worry, Argus, I got you. <laughs> Oh no! Alright, let's see, I'm gonna go in there and get him. I got him. Okay, I will get the last device. Squad member down. Oh, enemy nice. device is shut down. Good well, job. I got it. Oh no. I'm all good. <laughs> Oh no, that's Okay, I'm going toward y'all. Barrick, hang on. Oh, you're up. Oh, hi. We got a destroyer. Uh, now it all makes sense. I'll help you! I just love putting all the smoke around him so that I can't see anything. <laughs> that's one of my favorite things to do. Relax. Go get him. Oh, no. Gato's Quizzle! Welcome to the Anchor Fan. All enemies clear. Keep it up. And that's, my friends, why I love trip lines. Yeah, that was nice. <laughs> Just throw down 600 of them at the enemy's feet, and then run away. Are you limited on how many you have? Yeah, they're grenades, so... Okay. Oh, okay, it goes straight into a destroyer. I just wants to say hello. But I don't. <laughs> Argus also found another friend. Yeah, I got you. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Because uh -oh. I am a fantastic, a fantastic acrobat, when I die, I don't just die, I die Thank doing you. a backflip. <laughs> oh, oh gosh. Boy. I walked into the worst possible moment there. <laughs> I'm going for the nullifier. Got him. Take it. Yeah, it's a good spot. Hugs for destroyers. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Enemies headed your way. Gotta go. <laughs> oh my gosh! Everybody wants to be revived by anger. Um, well. The cross I have to bear. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I would say that 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 would be a cross, I guess, because I wouldn't want to be the designated reviver. That means everybody else is going to be dead, and you're going to be the only one. Soy me, welcome to the Anchor Fam. Did I kill two nullifiers? Where was the second one at? Holy crap, there was two of them there. Okay. Oh, and I'm down. <laughs> Don't worry, Anchor, I will be the dedicated reviver. Uh, wait, hold on, this is uh -oh. oh no, oh no. <laughs> 
He's just really adamant on, uh... Ooh, get behind cover. He's breaking Over my now. sound because he is so... so threatening. Fortunately enough, my turret took most of that damage. This uh, is an interesting location. This is what could possibly be wrong know how, here. I don't really know if I like. Oh yeah, the, that's um, right. The I property think. value of this location. <laughs> yeah, especially when the throwing in guys. Oh, oh my gosh! Get out of here! Oh my gosh! I barely made it. I bailed on you. <laughs> oh no. That was oh. perfectly fine. I'm just stuck on the walls. It's a rough neighborhood. <laughs> I love that kick. That just that just feels so squad member down. So tough. Argus. Argus, the most underrated sniper rifle, or, uh, sniper rifle, yeah, we'll go with that. The most underrated sniper rifle from Mass Effect 3. You know, the three-round burst thing that had horrible accuracy. Yeah, we'll call it a sniper rifle. Sure. What? <laughs> there, was a, there was a burst rifle called the Argus. I think it was the M55 Argus. Oh. That was one of the least light guns because it was very, oh, no. very inaccurate have... and had horrible kick. Oh, why did you have to be there? Why there? This is not good. Yeah, especially since he just eats freaking missiles for breakfast now. And he is really not liking me in particular. I think he knows what I did to his brother last night. Oh, do they interrupt the hat? Yes, they do. Oh, no. That's okay. He's gone. Okay. Uh, although, Team we'll get... I just killed everybody. <laughs> Guys, I want you to flag that. Like, take a clip of me <laughs> killing the entire team by destroying that destroyer. Just... That's, that's got to go down in history as one of the best moments in Mass Effect Dramata. I was complaining <laughs> the fact that there's no more possessed abominations. You killed us. Troll okay, life. This is going, ah, so, going. Goes so well. Oh, I'm just getting spammed got, by Yeah, we got a bail. Get out, go for it. Okay, we're safe over here. We could possibly go. Ah! <laughs> what could possibly go wrong? Is that what you were about to say? <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't just that I died. I was like, what could possibly go and just not got knocked flying across the map? Oh crap! <laughs> oh crap! I'm alive. <laughs> Man, I tell you what, we're all gonna have revive Thank medals, you. guys. It's gonna be awesome. Oh, breathe, breathe. What? Oh. You're welcome. Thank you. That's right, guys. I just sniped that nullifier with trip mines. Get on my level. Nice. <laughs> we got this. Yeah, we're doing good. We're distracting them all. It's actually a good strategy. Yes, it is. Oh, I can breathe for a little bit. I need to go. Oh, good. We're done. Need to get ammo. Yeah. I'll run away. 
It's it's not it's not being a coward. I'm making I'm making a, a tactical reposition. Yep. <laughs> he spins around like he doesn't know where the mines are exploding from. <laughs> By then it's too late. Nice job, Apex. Keep it going. This is insane. Okay, and this is the part where we all go to extraction from the start. What could possibly go wrong? Shuttle incoming. Get to the extraction zone. Everything. This is my favorite part. Look at this, guys. Like, that didn't even... That didn't One even take down. his shields down. Oh, I got you, Sir Argus. We are... Wait, get over this. Minute out here. Who fired first? Yes, that's right. Come I on. just made a Star Wars joke. <laughs> <laughs> 45 seconds. Okay. The destroyer seems to be focused on me here, which should give everybody else a nice uh, retreat. He's down. 20 seconds. Should probably get moving. Yeah, I'm heading over. Oh, on. Okay, we're right here. Let's toughen you up. Let's toughen you up. Ah. Oh. Down, everyone standing. Nice! So we did it! Uh, oh, oh my goodness. beer! <laughs> <laughs> oh, so so I'm getting requests for the uh, the Aturian attack chopper, I guess. So they did make some alterations to the Turian Havoc, so I suppose I can uh, test those out and see how that works. Now they buffed one of the the aerial. Uh, what is it called? Aerial something power. Okay, I haven't done him, I think, at all. I have his character, though. And, and just to be fair, the reason why I topped the scoreboard is because the Engarden Insurgent is also a, uh, a score... Um, a high-scoring character. <laughs> why am I trying to keep my language so PG? It's kind of funny. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, see, they were supposed to reset that. I guess they didn't. Okay, so aerial evade. Huh. Interesting. Did it not reset for you? Well, they didn't reset it. And also, it doesn't look like the change they made. Where's my little... Where's my notes? Where's my notes? Um, hold on a second. I am pretty darn certain that I saw a thing about that. Hold on real quick. Opening an arsenal five. pack here. I might have been crazy in just imagining it. Yeah, so Ooh. Apex training passive. Rank 5 aerial combat training. Oh, you know what? Maybe this is an Apex training? No, this is Aerial Assault. So it's for another character. Wh whoever has the Apex training passive. Um, rank 5 Aerial Combat is now Specialist Combat. And that's what got buffed. Okay. 
I was curious there for a moment. I was like, yeah, what is what is the deal with that? Okay, so anyway, yeah. So I don't think uh, I don't think we're too bad at position now. So. So I'm going to do my vanguard this next time. Do that. And... Ooh, cyclonic mod. See, now, this is where... This would be a... Gun damage 10% and power damage by 20% would be good with uh, kits like the Terrain Havoc and so on. Oh yeah, what's that? Uh, so is that... Where is that at? The Apex. Jeez. Three days to get 600,000 credits. And it has at least one ultra rare, one rare, five ultra rare experience enhancers. Oof. Oh, it's okay. It's only three days. Yeah. So they they are doing it for a limited time, and yes, mark all is red and watch them just keep coming back every darn time. And <laughs> yeah, I don't have a mark all is red here though. Why would we do that? <laughs> And two, you get an Apex pack from doing Deeper Into the Ruins again. Oh, do you? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I just got one. If you want to do Deeper that into mission the ruins, at some point. That a, oh, that's a silver. You know what? Sure. That'll be an ideal time for me to bring in my uh, attack chopper. <laughs> attack chopper. <laughs> you will understand very quickly why I call it that. Okay. All my characters are reset. Interesting. Well, Ooh. this guy was reset before, but not currently. So that might have been something that happened before. I don't know. Anyway, so let's go in. We, of course, um, according to Rose, I always have to add the cry. Why is this all out of order? I just realized that. So they do. They reordered all of my uh, my ammo powers instead of having all the cryo ammos and then the incendiary and so on grouped together now they group them by rank which mm -hmm. is kind of a little bit of a pain but i don't know yeah i had to get used to it i've come to find it kind of handy depending on if you want to match up your difficulty with the mm -hmm. level of amp you use but yeah no that that makes sense to experience enhancer. Yes, I do go through arbitrarily and mark things as red because I hate having those little unread markers. <laughs> Don't judge me. Where is the mark stuff as red? Oh, that's only in one thing. Oh, Here's the it? fun one is that... Uh, oh, and challenges. Okay. I'm, I'm actually thoroughly confused because here's my my question. I have a weapon thing that's... Oh, no, it's gear. Gear, that's where it's at. Never mind. Don't mind me. No, I guess that wasn't it. Somewhere I have an unread marker and it's popping up on my weapon. I am not going to sit there and fuzzle with that. We'll just get into the match. <laughs> because uh, that's just not wasting everybody's time at that point. <laughs> so in this match, I'm going to say... Oh, uh, it's a weapon mod. Okay, Lurk. Yeah, that they didn't use that actually light up the unread marker for mods, I didn't think. But I guess they do now. Oh yeah, I know all the unread markers will come back and uh, and my OCD will just like cause my eye to twitch. You guys will see me <laughs> off of that guy off of the, the original Pink Panther movies, the uh, sergeant on there that was like face was just twitching all over the place. That's what I'll turn into by the end of the stream. So by the way, um, the turning attack chopper you know the drill. is this wonderful, wonderful turning that will... Uh, <laughs> 
Awesome. She literally stays up here for hours. Especially when I start doing this. Up, observer, you're not the only one that can fly Five now. Where's he at? Mr. Anderson, welcome to the Anchor Fam. Thank you for following. <laughs> Mr. Anderson, welcome back. Squad member we down. missed. <laughs> I should probably stop with my, uh, my agents and references because they probably might scare me. <laughs> I really want them to make this a main mainline map already. Yeah, I really like this map. Relapse. Go get him. All enemies clear. Keep it up. I killed some what the heck did I kill? I don't know. <laughs> but you're kinda of seeing the, the tactic of mine here. Enemies headed your way. I actually am more durable and and more survivable when I'm in the air. Ah, oh, dang it, I keep on thinking I have my Vanguard equipped. Inspector Dreyfus, oh my gosh, yes! Lurk, you're awesome. Uh, someone that remembers the random nerd knowledge a little better than I do. Inspector, wasn't, he was Chief Inspector Dreyfus, at least by one of the, uh, one of the movies. Because, you know, he was, he was Cousteau's boss. Shot Cousteau? Where are they going? He got scared. Oh, for real, where did they go? This is kind of weird. There are those biotics. Because usually they swarm us. Whoa, what the heck? <laughs> and off the cliff I go! <laughs> I made it. Oh. Yeah, they're just like... I, yeah, I'm kind of wondering what they're doing there. It's uh, kind of I'll take this. This is a I'll nice little ammo. spot. I'm running out of ammo yeah. though, and I actually landed. Yeah, me too. Just three hostiles remaining. Wondering why I was dying so quickly. It's because uh... enemies down. Keep your guard up. So far, I have not needed to use turbo charge yet. Nice. Enemies incoming. Oh, nice. Yeah, I, I was not a big fan of the remake that they did of the Pink Panther, but the original ones, um, it's just, yeah, they, they are definitely classics. I haven't seen them in so long. It's definitely been a while, which is why I, I kind of was, like, lost on the name, because you know, that was probably just a ridiculous long period of time. 
That's right. I just completely face take that shot from the uh, from the nullifier and laughed at it. <laughs> Get down! It's, it's actually kind of scary how durable she is when she's in the air. It took me so yeah, that's long. That's awesome. Like Oh, destroyers coming up to say hello. Where is he at? Is he behind us? Squad member uh, down. Yeah, he's up top of that platform. Got it. That's it from me. I got this. I got this. Come on. Nice. <laughs> what weapon do you have? The Sonic. I'm an attack helicopter. Nice. So I've got I've got I've got a, uh, a Vulcan cannon, right? Gatling gun, and then I've got my missiles, aka flat cannon. I'm not sure, really sure how incinerate fits into that. Thing. The problem is, is that I have a problem with drifting a little bit too much. Changing directions is not always the easiest thing to do. Oh, wow. figure out an alternate fire button that I can hold while playing this character. That's one thing that was really tough with like controller versus keyboard is when you have to hold down certain powers. What is he doing? I just broke, apparently I broke the darn destroyer there. He was just standing there like, what the hell's going oh. I was curious, so I looked it up. I can't remember. Chief Inspector Dreyfus made his first appearance in the Return of the Pink Panther. Yes, yes, they were. We were. Lur Lurk uh, was just talking about how it's his favorite uh, favorite movie, and he just watched it with his dad on Father's Day, which is actually, I think, super cool. Intelligence needs data from your location. Yay! Why not a hack? Awesome drifting. seeing you float there. Down. Just drifting. Just watching the kill feed fill up, fill up with the sonet melting everything somehow. It's not even that strong. Oh, Until that I activate uh, you know, overdrive. And then I can't find a darn thing to shoot. And then I'm like, well, that was wasted. <laughs> bounds but I got him. I'm yeah, also dead. Uh -oh. <laughs> That's what happens uh -oh. when I stay on the ground too long guys. You can't. Yeah. Gotta, gotta stay on the bounce. You're meant to fly among the clouds. And a cookie oh, to anybody who can tell me where the quote stay on the bounce is from. 
that's how that's how you prove you're a true sci-fi fan. Oh, and I went out of bounds again. Three more to go. Oh boy. Enemies down. Keep your guard up. <sighs> Alright, now for the fun fun part. <laughs> oh, this is this is the fun part. I'll just float to extraction. Why not? Time to go. Yeah, as we're struggling side. behind, trying to make it. <laughs> oh, it feels so nice to have a bounce back in my hands. So my, uh, the game board that I use, uh, Logitech G13. Mm -hmm. My adorable and hard to be mad at bunny decided that she was going to snip the cable for it a while ago. Oh Finally, no! We were able to perform surgery. And bring it back to life. So for a couple weeks there, I was uh, without without my G13. I can't really game with a keyboard. I just I don't like using WASD for movements. It just feels broken to me. So okay. So I was pretty much relegated to playing with a controller for a while. There we go. How many missiles are you gonna throw down? <laughs> He's like, I just did I'm one. Like, oh, someone else left. That's probably what killed it then. Fifty nine. Wow, where seconds. did everything go? I probably shouldn't have pushed so early. Eh. That's okay, I'll just stand here and spray bullets in this general direction. Eventually hit something, right? 30 seconds. Was that was that your guess, Rose? Aurora Falls? Uh, for my for my quote? Because no, that that is not the correct answer. Does it count if I'm floating above extraction? I don't know. I'll play it safe. Mission complete, Oh! Thank you for that host, Chaos Killer. Yeah. Let's see what we got. Um, so, stay on the bounce was a very oft-repeated phrase from the book Starship Troopers by Robert Heinlein. Oh. It was, uh, not a lot of people remember that because obviously in the movie, the purpose for, uh, um, for that phrase was kind of lost in the way that they changed it in the movie. In the book, they used mechanized uh, exosuits that uh, their main form of travel was essentially by long jumping. Hence the term, stay on the bounce. All right. pack. Yeah, did you get the... Yep. Um, so okay. let's, see, let's see what goodies I got. So, Pistol Barrel, almost maxed out with that one. Rank, screw you for the human female vanguard. Uh. I'm, I'm not going to be very um, positive about seeing veteran ranks. <laughs> Although I did get the Inferno finally, which is nice. And I got uh, the Hurricane nice. 2, which is awesome. And another Screw You rank for the Human Male Sentinel. <laughs> okay. 31,000 credits. Artem, thank you for that follow. Welcome to the Anchor Fan. So the real question is, I, I, I always get tempted to spend that 100k to get a premium pack, but then I'm like, only 500 more of these matches to go before I can get uh, an Apex Elite pack on here within the next I know. two days. That's what I was just about to say. I don't know if I should save... I, I, I'm curious. I've got I've got to I've got to look at this really quick here. 
<laughs> what? How much is a thousand? Here we go. Okay. Oh, so, like to spend the mission funds so on it? That, that is, no, I, I was curious how many Andromeda points that was. That is a $10 package. Mm. A thousand Andromeda points is $10. Thereabouts. That's that's getting the 1,050 package, which, you know, yeah. I oh, was think, this a, huh. was was that the modifier? Was it one life to live on that? Was it? Deeper into ruins. We no, because we were reviving. Yeah, we were reviving. No, no, it's the recover the artifact one. I think that uh, that one of your viewers, uh, Danan, was talking about there. Um, oh yeah. Oh no, Rose! <laughs> I am not considering spending ten dollars on a freaking package. No. I was curious how much they were, they, I, I, I kind of was a little irked that they allowed it to be purchased with Andromeda points, but at the same time, yeah, I, I see what they're doing there. I can't really, can't really fault them for the, it's, okay, so a little gripe, I'm not going to go too long because so we're streaming with the anchor, so I'll keep my <laughs> usual ranting to a minimum. But whenever you have any kind of um, something that you can purchase with money and you add on a timer onto it, <laughs> I immediately scream foul. Like Steam Summer Sales, when they used to have the flash sales, ooh, buy this in tw the next hour or the next 12 hours. That is shady as hell marketing. That's what a used car salesman, you know, the stereotypical grease back air used car salesman, that's the tactics they would use. Hurry now, this this offer won't last. It's all to try to, uh, like, kind of force urgency into you so that you want to buy it. It's, uh, it, like I said, it's shady. It's not not my, uh, it's not cool to me. That's, that was my thing. I was, I was curious how much that they were charging for that too. Uh, hey, the Hornet is no longer a weak equalizer, Argus. The Hornet is actually legit strong. I did that for... What build guide was it that I used the Hornet? And it was... I finally got it! <laughs> it's, it's, it's... I was trying not to freak out while you were talking. I'm like, oh my gosh! <laughs> the, Ho the Hornet is amazing. I, uh, and I'm, I can't remember what the hell kit that I was... I think probably the Sentinel. Was it the Asari Sentinel that I used? I think so, because I looked at the Sentinel build that you made and also... Yeah. One other that was made around the same time, I think. Yeah, Lurk, Lurk said one it was of the, Asari, them. the Asari Sentinel. Yeah, and ooh, okay. it is, it is, it packs a punch now. Since they gave it that, that really nice buff early on, it felt great. Although... To be fair, I kind of mapped a, uh, a macro on my mouse for that that I can turn on that auto fires, like auto repeats, because otherwise it's finger cancer. Any of those semi auto yeah, <laughs> finger oh. cancer. I, I'm yeah. just not a fan of, uh, of having to, uh, you know, get carpal tunnel syndrome. So, are we doing a platinum again? Or did you have? Oh, did I'm you not... do the strike mission yet? Which oh the platinum strike mission? Yeah. Um no no I haven't and I have a feeling it would probably go horribly horribly wrong. <laughs> I don't I don't think I'm ready for uh, for platinum yet. Okay. And I say that mainly as of course that uh, um the LP config isn't isn't here. That's that's pretty much what I mean by not ready for platinum because. Let's be honest, all of the difficulty, like, difficult stuff that I've done, he's pretty much carried me through, which unfortunately has probably made my time more difficult. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so you get 4% um, bonus for a tier 1 veteran. Ugh. Irks the shit. Sorry. I'm, <laughs> I, I'm not, not ranting, not ranting. <laughs> it's Okay. <laughs> Uh, anyway, so let's see. I'm trying to clear out all of my exclamation points. 
it's, it's not gonna as soon as you complete the mission come back the next one it's the right back <laughs> sorry it's uh, i hate to break it to you but they're never going away <laughs> they'll haunt me forever yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah is, is the twitch the, the eye twitch thing yeah that's that, that's what that is you're All right. always there forever haunting you this thank you thank you for that appreciate it <laughs> mm. rojo life welcome to the anchor fan so let's see we're gonna do a silver again or what are we gonna do oh uh, we can do another gold since that's uh, obviously um gets us more credits towards that 600 freaking thousand okay Crazy. so i'll do my gladiator again Try to get her up to 20. I'm not gonna do that. Let's see. <laughs> that would be uh, that would be kind of brutal. Um, what? Let's see the uh, the gold uh, mission, which was uh, plus 100% shields minus 75% health. So it's pretty much once your shields go down, you're you're done. <laughs> Just mm -hmm. All right, so. Oh yeah, that's right. I was doing the. Uh, I need to. I need to get good with the human, human, uh, human engineer, because she's amazingly powerful. I guess, even though I'm really bad at. Uh, yeah. I've not done the human engineer yet. Well, essentially, the as as far as I've understood it, it's all about one of the uniquely powerful things, which is now going to be confusing as heck, right? Is the fact that now um, we've got the <laughs> the snap freeze upgrade for cryo beam, not to be confused with snap freeze the power on the new Batarian. I love Snap Freeze, by the way. That's one of my uh, N7 Paladins, my favorite kit from Mass Effect 3. So, uh, definitely a lot of fondness there. But yeah, so uh, essentially, where Snap Freeze is really nice, and I'm kind of torn on on kind of doing a cryo explosion build of the of this kit or Snap Freeze. What it does though, when you cryo beam an enemy, it freezes them like it normally does and if you shatter them by just shooting them and killing them normally while they're frozen they will do like 200 percent shatter damage to like a uh, few meters around them to other enemies and also freeze those enemies potentially as well um, oh wow so you can like chain these snap freezes together and it's crazy powerful hmm um, so they did actually kind of explain the lore behind the Batarian, um, Bev, is that oh, essentially yeah. there was two Batarians. Now that means that we may see a second Batarian pop up at a later time. In fact, I think that was hinted at a data mine that uh, was done at another time. But um, in any case, so the lore is, is that that Batarian and another Batarian were slavers and they essentially purchased passage on the uh, Andromeda Initiative ship to make a new life for themselves after they essentially turned state's evidence over on their uh, slaver group. So that's that's kind of what happened there. Um, so there is a lore, lore explanation on why they're there. It doesn't mean that there are a whole bunch of Batarians. Um, but yeah, and to be frankly honest, I agree with Cargo there. It doesn't does there really need to be a lore reason for multiplayer stuff? I mean, you know, Platinum in itself is not really lore friendly. <laughs> Heck, True. In Mass Effect 3, I would argue that the uh, you could send the uh, the humans from the Earth DLC, the uh, um, the N17 there. You could probably pair them up, put them on the ship, and they would uh, they would wreck stuff better than Shepard. Hmm. The, the, Especially as a team, yeah. Yeah, if you get the, the Paladin, the Slayer, the Fury, and the Demolisher, 
Ah, oh, the that, Fury. That would be like that would be like one of those like buddy cop dream team team ups. There, you've got the the, and to be honest, it's a bit tropey, right? So you've got the paladin who's kind of the leader of the group, the charismatic guy, right? And then you've got the slayer who's that. Okay, to be fair, usually racially stereotyped Asian person with a sword. Let's be honest, it's a stereotype in movies. Um, you've got the demolisher who's the sniper chick who's probably a little bit quirky and or potentially insane. Um, and the Fury, also possibly insane. I'm not really sure where I would go with that one. Uh, <laughs> well, I think I got them backwards. The, the Fury would be the crazy one and the... Um, the demolisher being the sniper would be the uh the i'm not sure what stereotype would you attribute to a sniper yeah i don't know <laughs> but yeah no, that would be right there that would be an awesome awesome dream team that would that would defeat the reaper single-handedly or quadra-handedly <laughs> all right so uh anyway I'm, I'm distracting myself here i was doing something here um, oh yeah, I was looking at that that lovely Carnifex. Um, oh, the Carnifex is awesome. Well, it's not just the Carnifex; it's the Carnifex Siphon One. Ew. So it appears. So, so the Carnifex. So I, I, I guess I, I get this now. Once you max out a weapon, is when you're able to get the mods of it, because the statistics for the Carnifex Siphon One match the Carnifex X that I have. Man, it looks pretty okay. cool, too. How are we doing on bonus stats? Getting kind of close to that health regeneration. Ooh, nice. Let's see. Oh, I guess that would be level two. Huh. On the health regeneration? Yeah. It's Yeah, usually you get level one of them pretty quick, and then it's the mm -hmm. level two that usually take, seems to take forever. <laughs> At least to me. Okay. Yeah. Okay, okay. I'm done playing around now. Let me actually uh, throw on something useful here, and then we'll get <laughs> Totally not taking up everybody's time by fussing around looking at guns. No idea what you're talking about. <laughs> I need to look at the, uh, the weapons, though, more. Study them up. Especially with the new stuff that they've added. The different variants. Mm -hmm. Twine, hello, welcome. Yeah, Twine, there is some fixes for single player as well as multiplayer. Mm -hmm. Although, obviously, the majority of this patch was multiplayer stuff. Um, they did, they've uh, continued their kind of uh, ongoing process of uh, fixing facial animations and that thing because they're literally going through and touching every face in single player so it's a it's kind of a extensive process I, I, I don't mm -hmm. I don't envy that process but uh, and, and then they're doing some other very like bug fixes and that sort of thing so. but yeah. Yeah, and I don't know exactly what they touched up either that was that was uh, I don't know who, what it. faces they kind of did not specify Oh, stupid that oh, siphon is not very powerful. Well, okay then. Oh no! <laughs> I saw the health come back, but uh, making my way over to you. On on a semi-auto okay, pistol, nice. it's just uh, not. Uh... I'm trying to see how much life it would bring back. And, uh... just hurt my ears. <laughs> what? That's when, that's when you know you're doing something right, apparently. Down. 
There we go. And that's the snap freeze, guys. Oh, I missed it. Essentially, I, like, I killed the guy. The wave ended, next. but we still have a wraith. Wait, what? The heck is going on there? Or at least we got the audio. I don't think that was right. Right? 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 That, I, I, I heard that too. That totally threw me off, but it, there was nothing. There was no no markers <laughs> on the screen or anything. Yeah, that was weird. Kandros. Was yeah, out that's right. Last night. Troll a little of all, Kandros. I got you. Who? Uh, Seventy eight. Welcome to the anchor fam. Oh, Where is he? There you are. Not fast enough. I really need to stop relying on this gun. I think I'm gonna switch over to what other gun did I bring? I hope it's a oh Falcon, yeah. Making my way over to you. Who's that making a comment about anchor anchor reviving you? There we go. Thank although you. Al although that's to be honest, that's not that common. I only die once every few Seconds. <laughs> yes, that shield. I'm glad I took the shield uh, upgrades for that. That's so much better now. This is cool. Right? Guys, look at that score. It's such a great score. What's the toggle for the leaderboard again? What's the total? Like as in, in mind and return to drop point. You're you're in second place. I'm in last place because I'm, I'm fantastic. Oh. Uh, oh, oh, I'm about to die. Oh, yeah, my seal. Hi there. Artifact is secure. See if I can't get him. Okay. I've got the annoyed pin down over here. Nice. I'm controlling people. Oh, it's not letting me through. Okay, there we go. Oh my gosh, I'm like, okay. <laughs> We're fine. Nothing to see here. Artifact recovered. Squad member down. Okay, this is just right I'm here. Oh my. Okay, so I was uh, tunnel visioning there for a second, look up, and everybody's dead. I'm coming to get you guys. See, this oh, device no. is just right here. Oh gosh. Okay, <laughs> let me recover this device and I'll make my way over to y'all. Oh no, that's alright. Uh, we got one of the guys here. Okay, I'm gonna get Argus. Oh Hang in there, no! Artifacts. Oh, he revived himself. Artifact is secure. I was I'm right there. And what? Was like... Whoa. That was weird. Did y'all see that? It's like I died, but I didn't. You are too powerful to die. What's wrong? I'm running away. Go out the window. Oh, he's dead. Oh gosh, but you're not. Holy gee, look at this Batman. All objects accounted for. Objective complete. Oh my gosh. Okay, trying to make my way to you, Sir Argus. Frenchu, welcome to the Anger Fam. You guys don't realize just how talented Anchor is, but we're in the middle of this like this heavy firefight, and she's still calling off followers. So it's no big deal. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. Wow, did not see that guy there. Ooh, is that a friend? I wanna, I wanna go have fun with him. Hi, friend. How are you doing? That's how we do it. That's a combo right there. Sensor's clear for now. Goodbye. Lucas Michael 20. Welcome to the Anchor Fam. Enemies headed your way. 
And for all of you just joining, uh, Nightbot has a rolling timer that will link a multi Twitch. I am streaming with Angelus Del Mortiel. Go ahead and give him a follow as well. If you that haven't is the yet. Case. Apparently, she's actually she's carrying me through gold, so. Cover what you got! Oh, and I fell. Okay. I think there's people under here. Oh, no gosh. That fiend is really on it today. Oh. <laughs> oh, right. okay. I'll I'm come not, up and I'm not, I'm not drawing you guys into that mess. <laughs> Oh no. I want my overcover grabs back. You know, that's that's the truth of it. Oh, stupid Team Oh no, you died you died again. Oh and there I go. <laughs> so uh do you uh do you die here often? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you thought you were gonna stomp me, but uh, Argus there, Argus has something else to say. Let's see. I'm revving. I really try to hit those weak point kills. See, if I get the concussive uh, modification on the weapon, that's where stuff really gets fun. That's the one where if you, uh, if you kill an enemy with a, uh, like a headshot or a weak point kill, it triggers a biotic explosion every time. Just three hostiles remaining. I accidentally barely touched him and he died. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Didn't even intend it. We're tracking reinforcements. I'm not a violent person, I swear. I just shoot <laughs> things a little. Hostiles on route. Uh, I'm totally safe up here. Oh no, I'm not. No, I'm not. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> I know, I saw you up there. Night Rose 2016, welcome to the Ender Fan. Night Rose is my is my moderator. They have an ascendant! Yeah, what now? What now, Mr. Anointed? I got a present for you. No, don't don't melee, run! Whenever I've got an ascendant right in front of me, I prefer to, uh, to instead of running away from them, I prefer to run towards them, give them a hug. And I think that's really what the problem is with, uh, with the Andromeda Galaxy is everybody's just angry. That doesn't seem like a very <laughs> strategy, in my opinion. It's a very cunning strategy. Wait, what's the opposite of cunning? Sadly, Snap Freeze doesn't go through oh, obstacles, it. it seems. Oh, shit. Well, I'm gonna run and try to save Anchor. My hero! I gotcha! Uh oh. As I hopefully don't die myself. Uh, as I died myself. Squad member down. Mm mm. As I realized that. Oh my gosh. I think I'm actually going to, uh, <laughs> I'm, Next time I'm more than me. likely probably, oh my god, Caleb did Oh, it. audio glitch. I'm glad that they fixed that, you know. Well, apparently it's something deeper into the code. Like yeah, and that would make itself. sense. Varric! No! Varric! Save the chest here! Save the, the books! 
Oh, this is really weird with the audio glitching on me. Hey. <laughs> it's your game silent. Just... Well, I'm getting random, like, pops. Like, I'm getting some. Now, that one I've seen is usually triggered by an enemy like the Ascendant here. Um, okay. once the, and then once the Ascendant dies, it, like... It... Oh, see, like, I don't have it anymore now. Yeah, so whatever the enemy was just died, I think it might have been that guy that was just right there that we killed. He just wants to give us puppy kisses. We've located data sources. Get them yeah, that totally puppy makes puppy. sense when you think that his way of greeting you is, of course, giving you kisses on the face. And by kiss on the face, I mean he tries to bite your arm off. <laughs> See, that was a puppy kiss right there. Huh. And I gave him one right back. Oh, oh crap! Hey, I no! Him, I him no, 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 no! Oh, I Did he get you? Well, I'm... No, you're down. I... That's right! Sync <laughs> kills, by the way, folks. Sync kills no longer kill you permanently. They just make put you in a down state. Thank you. This is... Oh, I'm panicking. Well, that's why I left. I abandoned you guys. Because I'm apparently just a horrible human being. <laughs> Oh, I'm like right underneath these. Oh, what you got? Oh, gosh. Seriously, guys. Alright, I'm going to Charlie. I am. Oh my god, he's right there! <laughs> Listen, I am not cool with this whole, like, you sneaking up on me thing. It's, uh, we're, we're gonna have to talk about this. You're way too big to be sneaky. Okay, he's down. Good grief. <sighs> Fiends should not be sneaky. Okay, we got one. Oh, gosh. I'm almost done with mine here. Alright, mine's good. Oh, I gotcha. I gotcha. I apparently <laughs> also. I also apparently dodged asses bit by some. Lost my shield. Oh, I snap freeze them. Teammate injured. I killed two enemies with that, but I died in the process. Worth it. Worth it. I would do it again. All right, come and get you. Uh, no. No. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Well oh. played. Sweet. Them anointed it dodged this right in him because Oh my. What happened in here? No, you don't. <laughs> Darn it! Oh, those anointed! They're just they're just oh gosh. terrible. Okay, we uh we gotta get this unlock down here. We're... I guess we got time. Upload complete. Well done. Nice. Got him! Oh! I'm out of there! Oh, I didn't make it! I didn't make it. <laughs> I noticed that I have very low survivability playing with her. She is definitely a uh, pretty weak kit defensively. Oh, get out of there! Oh 
Go him. There we go. You made a mistake. All enemies clear. Keep it up. We are still alive. I'm not sure how. I'm still trying to figure that out. Oh wait, I know I how. Get to the extraction site. Who's We're Ver so skilled, Ver you know. Verric and Sir Argus. That's how. Yes. <laughs> just in case any of you guys are wondering, streamers are actually mediocre gamers, and we just rely on people playing with us to carry us through <laughs> missions. Well, and our attention is so diverted too. That's true. I, I Come on, mostly get your make shield down. Because I'm not always bad at games. They ignore me! Pay attention to my turn over there! There's three anointed over there, oh my goodness. Thank you, Fiend, for helping me reload my health. Oh my god! No, 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 no! <laughs> well, that sounded bad. Oh, I escaped. Whoa, the Fiend just teleported across the map for me. And that's actually why they removed the, uh... Uh, they removed the, uh, uh... Thing. The... The sink kills actually killing you is because of the fact that they were having so many problems with, uh, you know, they couldn't fix the, uh, oh, the sink. The I'm getting up. Moving toward extraction. Kill the frozen guy, kill the frozen guy. There we go, snap freeze. Oh man, look. Look what we have coming toward us. Seals. What? Do we have something coming towards us? Well, he's dead now. Hiding <laughs> <laughs> behind cover. Oh my gosh, a grenade! That's oh, okay. Well, uh, huh? We made it. <laughs> <laughs> Barely. Right at the last second. Oh. Sounds good. Boss, welcome to the Anchor Fam. I don't know if I said hello. <laughs> welcome. Thank you for the follow. Oh, that was intense. And that was only gold. Yeah. It was especially intense for me because I'm I'm still I still have not quite figured out exactly how to get this human female engineer to work for me. Like Doing it the way people suggested, as I've noticed oftentimes, doesn't always work for me. Oh. Gosh, I love those rank 4 experience uh, uh, guys on there. So great. Just watching them level up multiple times after a mission. Mm -hmm. So good. Ugh. Oh, and I'm finally 20 on this character. Let's see what we can do with her. Don't worry, level 20 is no longer the end. <laughs> True. So I know a lot of people are going to get angry at me, except for LP, um, because I'm actually going to try to spec. Let's see, is it Brittle Freeze and then Crowd Trap? Yeah. So I'm going to spec for Cryo Explosions, which means I want to take Overload and spec that into. Recharge speed, and then chaining and chaining. Yeah. I gave in to temptation. I had to open up an expert pack. <laughs> it's tough to resist it because it just, you know, it's taunting you. And I got boosters and shadow, a shadow. Shadow three. Yeah. Nah. I'm not too enthused. <laughs> the shadow, hey, the, now the shadow used to, I used to make fun of the shadow. I used to call it the super soaker 
Um, you know, I, I was I was cruel to that guy. Super soaker. It was it, it was bad. It was just plain freaking bad. There was no there's no polite way to put it. It was yeah. as far as redeeming features, there were none. Uh, like, it, was, it was just that bad um, <laughs> so but they they buffed that one a while ago too and it actually appears to be you know in a bunch better state now and I'm kind of happy for that because it really needed it badly okay so well, that was the last match for me tonight yep yeah, it's the same thing for me as well because, well, you know, I, I, uh, I've been sitting in this 90 degree office for far too long. Oof. Well, and I have this sweater on too, so. I, I, I was curious. I heard you mention you got that sweater from Loot Box, and I'm like, aren't you yeah. in Texas? How do you do that? Well, <laughs> we have air conditioning. That's so. true. That's true. <laughs> So that 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 does make a, a significant difference whenever it comes down to it. Unfortunately, yeah. around here, because warmer temperatures w weren't the norm until more recent years, a lot of homes don't have AC. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, other places I've lived, they're like, oh yeah, no, it gets stupid hot here. So uh, so now since we're doing this stream together, I have an idea. We should tag team raid somebody's channel. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> like, what's going Good on? Good idea. Good idea. So I see currently we've got size. Oh, there's that anchor six five four person. We could raid her channel. <laughs> we also well, have Spurious, who's playing Me uh, uh, Deus Ex as well. Okay. So I'm always a fan of whenever uh, Size is playing his XCOM two run through, which apparently there's a uh, an anchor. Uh, at least in his Yeah, rotation. I should have a character. I don't know if they they're recruited yet or not, but <laughs> yeah, I think I think he put a, uh, one into the uh, rotation last I checked, but it actually has not yet been recruited. But that was a while ago, so he might have recruited you by now. Maybe we'll have to check it out. <laughs> so is that is, should we uh, should we throw him, uh, toss uh, toss hosts on him? Yeah, that sounds good. Uh, and Herbert and Nin Dreams, welcome to the Anchor Fam. Yeah, that sounds good. Thank All you right. so much for joining tonight. That was fun. Yes, that got was through one platinum. <laughs> well, <laughs> you got so through a platinum. I got through five minutes of a platinum. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, yeah. yeah, we might have to reconsider this at some point. Uh, <laughs> but yes, yes, the one stream day. the stream is ending. J Dell, sad face. Yes. But uh, but sleep and and things must occur as well. So. <laughs> Uh, but in yes, any case, thank you all so um, much for joining. Rose, if you're still in the chat, could you go ahead and throw down, um, I believe it is, I miss my short codes, it's been so long since I've streamed, I forget all my, my codes. Um, oh, no. Is it, is it, oh yeah, it's exclamation point SO, anchor 654, that's the one. <laughs> and also in my chat, there's a link to Angelus's channel, that's the voice you are hearing, go and give him a follow as well. All right, there we go. Okay, so in any case, um, we're gonna go ahead and throw a host over to uh, uh, to size sixteen, who's playing some XCOM two. There, uh, he throws on um, Mass Effect mods on there, um, so it's kind of like he's playing X Mass Effect. <laughs> yeah, it's really interesting and voice packs and everything. It's a lot of fun. Yeah, so we're gonna go sign off here, guys, and uh, throw a host over to him. Sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys have a good night. We'll have catch you next night, time. Everybody.